Hey, Shalom. Thank you, Lord. Praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shai, Bashem, and Kakadash. Double honors to our apostles, the great millstone, our elders, the GMS. Okay, and salutation, peace, and blessings. Blessings to the hopeful elect of the children of Israel. This labor is true. People of Negro, Latino, Native American, Seminole, Indian descent who make up the 12 tribes of Israel. Okay, Israelite foreigners. You may look like the heathens, but Yahweh and Yahushai have scattered amongst the four corners of the earth, but have the spirit of an Israelite, and you are quite a sum of yourself as well. Okay, this is more of a, a little bit over an old out uh, a year old, uh, article on this prophecy that's coming to pass. But um, I just wanted to go back and revisit it because it's not going anywhere. And uh I'm going to read a few things in here to uh, showing you that we're headed that direction at a full scale. And uh, so, and look at the excuse they're using the novelty of replacing one's home key with a microchip. is gaining worldwide interest, but but there's another more compelling story under the surface. Why is this technology an integrated circuit the size of a grain of rice? Reveled by some and celebrated by self-proclaimed human cyborgs. But this cut my eye here and arguably. Nothing is neither good nor bad, but thinks thinking makes it so. However, it would be prudent to tell Prince Hamlet that not all micro Things are designed alike, and understanding the technological design enables one to better evaluate the competing viewpoints. Today, more than 50,000 people have elected to have subdermal C hips surgically inserted between the thumb and the index finger. Wow. 50,000. And again, I'm speaking on that for the simple fact that it's biblical prophecy, whether it's old news or not. But let me go to the search engine. See what is if there's anything recently mentioned on it. There's a YouTube video. Tech company implanting payment. See hips into your hand. What's this here? The rise of micro C hipping. Let's see what this is all about. And this is what we want. To come to pass sooner the better the sooner the better and all we have to do is stay strong and um resist the temptation which let me say something you know it's tempting to get out want to get out and go hang out with friends and family and you know, the bars and, you know, it's tempting, but using your common sense, you know, just from experiences, a lot of those experiences going out. But for example, uh, the last few times straight, I head to a bar, there was always a sign telling me and showing me that I shouldn't be there in the first place. You know, with spirit telling me I'm overdoing it. I cut it back. And even though I cut it back, I went to visit, there was still signs showing me that no this is not the place for you period so i literally learned that i you know <laughs> just stay away from it because this old saying uh, uh guilty by association we uh we use this uh you know you, you don't you don't want to be around the two-thirds when they're judged because you might get hit in the crossfire like a military term, huh? what do they call it? Um, 
uh, the victims when they dying in the war, just uh, victims getting caught in the crossfire, victims of war or whatever. Uh, same with this chip, man. When the period comes, that temptation, our temptation, you know, the sign's already there. You know, that why you shouldn't. And not because he's, and the main reason because Yahweh Bush and Yahweh Shai tells you not to. You know, there's another reason, you know, re receiving it, it has consequences. You burning and you catching complications, tumors and cancers and so on. But that our temptation. You know, learning to suffer now, experiencing suffering now. You know, Yahweh Bush and Yahweh Shai is preparing you, you mentally to be able to suffer then and deal with it. Look at all this. Instead of carrying your wallet, a British Polish company wants you to carry it under your skin. Keep it says key points. The company sells micro hip C hips as alternate payment options that allow you to pay with your hands. The first micro C hip was implanted in him back in ninety eight, but the technology has been available commercially only in the past decade. The pay with your hand is a little bigger than a grain of rice and weighs less than a gram. You can use the, the thing to pay wherever contactless payments are accepted. There's an old saying that goes, I have got money in hand, and now the rising technology that's going to be true. The British Polish company is developing a way of putting money in your hand, not in the traditional way, but in a whole new way, and it got many people talking. You know, those it's kind of quiet right now. This technology coming in is kind of quiet, but at the same time, it's not. It's happening. It's happening. The company sells in plantable payment payment system things that you can use to pay wherever con contactless payments accepted. The world has been working on such technology for a few years, but until the past decade, the technology was available commercially. The tech is natural is a natural advancement in the way that we make payments. So it's coming. Yet I don't know how old and new this this one is. You know, it doesn't say. Alvarez Technology Group. Our purpose, Mitchell from CEO. See what their purpose is. Alvarez Technology Group believes that a strong set of core values helps us to maintain an undeniably superior service. Our comprehension IT solutions will help your business grow and succeed in your competitive field by getting the most out of your technology. Clients come first for our family owned, I own IT service and support team. <laughs> Alvarez. This is from CEO. See here. Oh, they me right away up the Wikipedia. Hmm. 
I wanted to find out the, the founders and the company type, private, LLC, industry, professional services, founded in 83, 41 years ago, founder, Tony Alvarez II, Brian Marshall, various service, key people, notable projects, Lehman Brothers. Brian Marshall was probably one of the first people contracted contacted by Harvey Miller on hearing that Lehman Brothers was likely to need a, to file for Chapter 11 protection. All right. Okay. <clears throat> so here's a whole article to justify the coming, you know, why it should be accepted. The technology makes payments in hands possible. You can read all this on your own. No need to carry anything to make payments. The potential dark side of see hip and hand technology. Let's read that. Eavesdropping on device communications, wage interception attacks, and corrupt data. Well, that's going to come with any uh, technology. If you are so concerned about the invasiveness and security nature of the payment chip implantation, there's fear, uncertainty, and cert concerns about human micro. See, his U.S. lawmakers have been calling for a preemptive ban on human chip. The lawmakers argue that while micro CFDs offer alluring benefits of speed and convenience, they carry privacy and security concerns. The major concern with the NFC technology is that it can allow third parties to do the following. All right, so most people are also concerned that the, the C hipping implantations can reveal a lot of personal data, such as your health status, your Whereabouts? How often do you work? How long do you work? Where you, where you on, where, where you're on breaks? <laughs> Advocates of C hip and hand technology insist that they're safe. But again, according to the scriptures, they're not safe. Fourteen, and the smoke of their torment ascended up forever and ever. And they that, and they have no rest day nor night, nor worship the beast and his image, and whosoever receiveth. Mark in his name. Is that Mark there, Karagma? It has to be Karagma. There it is. Cool. Yeah, it's Karagma. Okay, so... Revelation 14 and 9, and the third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, If any man worship the beast and his image, and receive his mark in his forehead or in his hand, the same shall drink of the wine of the wrath of the Most High, which is poured out without mixture into the cup of his indignation, and he shall be tormented. <laughs> of course it's not safe.
flesh upon a plot of torture to torture to be to vex with grievous pains of body or mind to torment to be harassed and distressed you see that's a literal sense so our point is to tell you not to our point is to warn you of these times that are coming you know most specifically on the hour of judgment uh, the hour of temptation that's what we're warning you of the hour of temptation your stomachs will be growling stomachs will be growling the black woman will be in the black man's ear so-called black woman will be in the so-called black man's ear crying nigga do something i'm leaving <laughs> we need to eat baby's crying the hour of temptation It says the future is here for people tired of taking out their wallet or phone to make payments. That's just straight lazy. You know, people are being conditioned to be even more lazier as time goes by. Lazier and lazier and lazier. You know, they want everything instantly. Instant. Right away, immediately. Fast food mainly. Just people don't want to cook. Microwave oven. Well, I'm guilty of using the microwave oven to heat food up sometimes, but no. Not prepare smoothies. I prefer a meal cook. So let's get that real quick. Time of Jacob's trouble. Revelation 3 and 10. Because thou hast kept my word of my patience, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth. And there's always that mess has been pushed out by the prophets. You know, mainly great millstone. The prophets, the men of the Lord. Um, that this famine that's coming, you know, that these this hour of martial law is coming. You know, which is all through the scriptures. Okay. It's prophecy, it's part of prophecy. So Yahweh Bush and Yahweh is going to keep us from that from the that hour from that you know I will also keep thee from the hour of temptation of being just just being tempted to do something that you that may possibly be harmful to you. He's going to keep your mind from that and you know from that the whole time. He's going to protect in your mind just to, even the doubt or questioning of it. He's going to protect you in that in the, in your mind. You know, just the, the, what what the men, the true men of the Lord get to look forward to in this time, of, in this hour, man, this horrible hour is just nothing but comfort. Nothing but comfort, man. That's why it's important when you at, you know, the, um, uh, no, uh, no. Uh, been, that's why it's important to fight the furnace that we're being put through. You know, it's a it's a time to uh, uh, dig in and prayer with, and it's it's a time to dig in and really put that spirit of being a soldier into play, man. You know, it's that time to endure.
how a tech group can help your business stay on top of technology advancements. So that's the end of it. So if you want to, that's it right there, the Alvarez Technology Group. Let's see, let's see what else, if there's something else. That might be it. April 2023 Banking and Financial Service Amazing Technology naturalnews.com central bank planning to introduce CBDCs brothers go to naturalnews.com a lot so that seems to be it okay under Wikipedia itself January 30th 2024, Time Magazine, How Implanted Brain Chips Like Ours Could Change Our Lives. That was part of the miracles. Future of Banking AI in the banking industry. I need to uh, study this AI and this technology and how to use it. I mean, I'm clueless. I'm not tech smart at all. Brothers, some brothers are. That seems to be it. New technology in banking automated digital signal and interactive interactive display technology. There's nothing. All right, shallow one.